and today I'm going to show you how to do a sand install. We've already drilled, pre-drilled the hole and pre-made our slurry. And you can see how to do those in other videos on AgSpy. So here we got these pink flags. These are, we're pretending these are the, the crop or the plants in the row. With sand, instead of putting the slurry in the hole first, we put the probe in the hole. And then we're gonna pour the slurry around it and down the hole. Because we don't want that sand going to the bottom and we can't then we can't get our probe in. So then we're gonna work it around like that, and you'll see as I work it, you see the sand fall to the bottom. Then you'll have to throw dump some more in. Work it around. Oops. And let it, once it quits falling to the bottom, then you know you're full. Then you'll take your shovel, get rid of the excess slurry, just like you would on a normal install. Then you're going to take some sand and make it look like nothing was ever here around the probe. On sand installs, I'm always, I always run the install through service by right away to make sure the sensors are good. If you have a sensor reading bad with the red line and service by, a trick I learned is take this fiberglass rod here and you may have to tamp sand down around the probe and you'll find a, maybe find a spot that there's not very much sand in. But you don't know if you have to do that until you run it through service by and find out. That's how you do a sand install. 